This video demonstrates the process of developing a mobile automation test script using Fireflink. The user can either start a new test automation project from the All Projects section by clicking on the Plus Project button. Further, they will be prompted to enter the name of the automation project along with selecting the type of the project as mobile or web and mobile if they want to script for both web and mobile apps. Once the type is selected, additional fields will be enabled, including the app type where the user can choose between native or hybrid options. The user can then select the platform based on their test automation requirements and choose the desired platform, then click on the create button, which will create a new test automation project. On the other hand, the user can also make use of an existing test automation project that is of a mobile or web and mobile type. For that, ensure that you are in the desired module, then click on the plus icon. The user can create a new script or add an automation script to an existing manual test case. Select the desired option and make the necessary inputs and selections. The user will now be taken into the created script. Make use of the inbuilt NLPs to build the script using simple English. In this test scenario, we are trying to validate if the user can view their shopping profile for an e-commerce mobile application. To begin, we will set up the desired capabilities to launch the mobile application. Please note, this is a one-time process. Later, the user can easily reuse the same set of automation steps by creating a step group, eliminating the need to rewrite them for each script. Enter desired as an input, in the NLP search section, select, create instance of desired capabilities, NLP. Within the input parameter, make use of a global variable, cap. Enter desired, and select, set capability key, NLP. Here, we will provide device information in the text fields. Further, we will use the same NLP to set the capability key for the platform. Input the further details. Now, set capabilities for app package and add the NLP. Set the capabilities for app activity and add the NLP. Set the capability to avoid auto logout using a no reset set to true. Add the app open NLP. With the following set of NLPs, you will automate the process of launching the mobile app. You can now select the set of automation steps and click on the plus step group button to use it repeatedly across scripts. Now, enter the rest of the NLPs and build the mobile test automation script to verify the test scenario. It's important to note that mobile scripts can be executed on physical devices connected to the system, virtual devices such as emulators or simulators, and even cloud-based platforms. Here, we will make use of a connected device. 
Click on the Run icon from within the test script and observe the automation taking place on the mobile app. Post execution, the user gets automation results for every automation step added, along with a consolidated result, at a script level. Click on the script status to derive more insights on the mobile script execution. To summarize, we have demonstrated the method to establish a mobile test automation script, set the desired capabilities, and executed a mobile test automation script on a connected device. Thanks for watching this video. For more information, visit www.fireflink.com and schedule a free demo today.